witches and mundanes. In this video, I'm going to share with you a very simple working, a very simple monthly working that you can utilize to invite good vibes, to to bring about good change and, and protection, inspiration, you know, love into the home, into your experience, and it really is great to utilize this um, to set the intent, to set the tone uh, for the coming month. Um, basically, you do this on a Friday, the first Friday of each month, and it empowers the home, empowers the, you know, you and the individuals that are entering your space, okay? And so, very simple, again, um, what you'll need is obviously something to, to mix your herbs in, uh, to grind your herbs. You'll need pink salt, white sage, angelica, hyssop. Uh, cinnamon, I use like three cinnamon sticks, um, rosemary, and cedar. Okay, very simple, and if you've been witching, you should probably have all of these on hand. Uh, pink salt, I start with, and I usually use more than what I initially mix. I'll put a little bit of pink salt into wherever I'm mixing, um, and, you know, pink salt is a good purifier. It cleanses, it protects, and pink is associated with love, heart connection, and just connection on a, a very um, cosmic, universal scale. It, you know, it networks people and individuals, and it connects us, and it helps us to have compassion and understand. You know, and salt's very good at protecting. It's very good at purifying and cleansing and, um, you know, really uh, getting rid of toxicity and getting rid of toxic energy uh, at the same time as really bringing in, you know, all that we need and all that we desire. And cedar, cedar's great at, you know, similar things. It invites good spirits, it, it uplifts the space, it uplifts the air, it uplifts the energy. And so when you add that to the pink salt, it, it connects with it and it helps to really promote good vibration, good spirit, good energy to enter the space. All right, cinnamon. Cinnamon is great for, you know, love working. Cinnamon is great to bring in that, you know, very, um, love essence, that sensual nature, that playful nature, but it also spices things up. It invites um, that good energy and it, it, it speeds things up. It speeds the process up. So it helps uh, all of these uh, energies to come together and to just get shit done. Um, and so that's why we utilize cinnamon. Angelica, Angelica sort of uh, invites that heavenly presence, it invites like angels, it invites good spirits, again, and it protects and it helps to ward off evil. So you can see with this blend already, as we bring in good energy, as we bring in good vibes, and we, you know, bring in all this, you know, protection and this greatness, um, we're at the same time, we're pushing out and we're keeping at bay and we're warding off uh, negative influence and bullshit, individuals, uh, gossip and all that crap okay and rosemary rosemary i like to use because it invites again it invites good energy good spirits but it also represents beauty it, it represents youth and it helps us to um, have a youthful mind it helps us to really understand you know uh, what it's like to be adventurous and have fun and feel you know, happy and feel beautiful. And when we feel good about ourselves, you know, everything else is like, great. You know, everything else is, we feel good about ourselves. And so, you know, that sets our, you know, energy for the day. You know, the day's gonna be pretty good. So that's why I like to use rosemary. You know, in Hyssop, uh, it really uplifts energy. It, it heightens that positive vibration. So when you have Hyssop, you can um, pretty much do whatever you need to do and hyssop cleanses and clears everything so it's like it um kind of like how you know people see a uh, baptism you know you're washing away and you're 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 preparing yourself and you're uh bringing clean and you're uh setting the tone for a different life um so hyssop has that that power uh and i like utilizing it in this um because it protects and and if you do any sort of malediction work in your home um this also keeps you in a very pristine nature and it keeps the vibration of the home uh in in good spirits okay and so uh white sage white sage i like using because again 
just like almost everything else here, it uplifts. It, it uplifts the energy. It keeps things in a very um, constant, uh, uplifted and heightened state. And so when things are constantly being heightened and, and elevated and, you know, you have this very positive nature always happening is very hard for um, negative debris, negative spirits, negative entities, negative shit to, you know, pass that threshold. It's really challenging because you have this energy, this, this vibration where it's constantly being lifted. Um, so it has no place. It, it does not invite negative uh, energies um, into the home. Okay. So that's why we use that. And all of these, uh, these, herbs invite that they they uplift and they heighten the experience and they bring this very positive this very golden and pristine this very regal uh, energy so that negative shit cannot penetrate all right and so you mix those and, and as you mix them you want to make sure that you're focusing on you know the vision you're, you're you're focusing on that in your mind you're seeing you know this positive nature you're seeing the love connection you're seeing you're seeing you know those who enter your home entering in a very um a very passionate way and, and, and they have inspiration and, and they're happy and they're you know kind and they're gentle and they're compassionate when they enter they have they feel good when they enter your home you're seeing this and as you see this you know you're creating the herbs you're setting the intent and you're making sure that they understand what they're doing here um so not only should you see it you know do your best to, to visualize that and visualize smiles on everyone in the home and just visualize that good good vibes um you're focusing on the feeling you want to feel it you want to feel that power working together to create that desire that you want so you need to see it you need to feel it and then you know if you have a chant if you have anything that you want to to say as you mix and you grind the herbs do that you know something personal but uh yeah you know that just that creates it even more and so as you're mixing it you mix it mix it mix it come up with your good blend and then take what you've mixed and add it to more salt you want your base you want the base of of the formula of the blend to be salt so add the herbal blend to more salt um and then what you do is sprinkle it over your uh your porch over the front entryway um, anything outside you know if you have steps whatever but you sprinkle it on the first Friday of each month you'll take that blend and you'll just sprinkle it all over you know your entryway your porch your the steps whatever you have in front of the house do that or and, and you know what I would do as well depending on you know how many doors and how many uh, points of entry to the home Wherever someone's going to enter, place this blend at. Okay? <clears throat> so, and what I do is I leave it there. I leave it there. So anytime someone steps on it, they are entering with good essence. And as they leave, they're leaving and taking that with them. So they're taking that good vibration, that good energy with them. Very simple very effective um, and again build you know build your own technique um, add or take away whatever you desire make sure to know why um, and, and do this every Friday do this every every Friday of the first y'all I can't even talk the first Friday of every month so do that um, and have fun with it and uh, if you want to know a little bit more and different ways you can you know alter it I will put in the description below uh, a little more information on each herb and then I'll have a blog link to um, my blog uh, that has a little more information but if you do something like this or if you do something similar uh, I'd love to hear what you do if you'd like to share so comment below and I will talk to you soon peace